experience today, just getting back into the to the off season. Wanted to sharpen up some things that I knew I had issues with during the season. And that's really what the off season about. Come in here and work on the things that you know you're not good at. We all can work on the things that we're good at and it's fun, but getting in here and doing the things that you're not good at, set your ego to the side, that's really when you get better. And it's not even just with football, it's in life. You're not always gonna be in the best position. Things aren't always gonna be perfect for you. I'm sure we all have experienced things that where life just kind of kicks you when you're down. And it's all about how you respond and how you uh, adjust the situation. You don't wanna let it consume everything. You don't wanna let it be the, the end, the complete end, because someday football gonna end. And you gotta know how to act on that end. But when you in it, you win it. So you gotta give everything you got. But at the same time, you know. Oh, it's definitely, definitely not for me, but for um, You know, I've been been on teams here up north one day, and then the very next day, I'm completely across the country. And not knowing what team I'm going to be on, not knowing if I made it, if I didn't make it, it's, it's definitely uh, troubling. But, you know, I got my faith, so that's the number one thing that I lean on when things get crazy. Other than that, I just rely on myself. I know that football doesn't yeah. define me as a human, as a, as a, as a man, so I know that. And also, I believe in my ability also. Well, you know, I'm a, I'm a follower of uh, Jesus, Jesus Christ. And, you know, it's, it's, it's easy to, to, to be a follower when, when things are great. I mean, I, mean I, 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 can, I can say I've been a victim of that. When things are great, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm not even paying attention. And then when things get bad, who am I leaning on? So it's, it's, it's really about being consistent. And that's what I've been trying to get better at throughout this whole NFL process, because without Without God, I mean, I don't know where I'd be at right now. So just leaning on him and leaning on my faith has really got me to where I'm at today. So when you in the off season and you uh, notice some things you want to work on, what keeps you um, consistent? Because there's going to be days where you're very sore, don't feel like doing it. You know, what makes you get up? And fight. Is it the fact of you being a free agent or moving around from team to team, or is it? What? Uh, it's a few different things that definitely plays a part. Because um, I know I can make it in this league, and you know I'm on I'm on the Saints right now, but nothing's guaranteed. So I know that I gotta go as hard as I can every day. But ultimately, it's really just your why. You gotta think about your why. Why you do mm. this? Why you do this? It could be, it could be your your wife, it could be your kids, it could be your faith, it could be people doubt you, it could be your hometown, it could be whatever you want. It, it don't even matter. Just if you got a chip on your shoulder, it's gonna get you up in the morning. Yeah. 